Guma Sumba by-election has continued to elicit discussion about the future of Ukambani politics. Timothy Maneno's win came despite a heavy effort by the Wiper Party to win the seat. As various leaders, including Deputy President William Ruto and Mark Winnie Governor Kibuta Kibwana, saw the result as a sign of political change. Calvin Kodalo with that story. <laughs> Following yesterday's result in the Ngu Masumba by election in Makuni County, questions have emerged about the future of politics in the region. Timothy Maneno, an independent candidate, emerged first in the by election, sparking celebrations led by Makuni Governor Kivuta Kibwana. Maneno won the seat after he garnered 2,894 votes ahead of candidates of UDA and Wiper parties that had made a big splash during campaigns. Nonetheless, political stalwarts Wiper leader Kalonzo Musioka and Deputy President William Ruto also congratulated Timothy Maneno for winning the award by election. However, Ruto also billed the result as a sign that the electorate was now more concerned about issue-based politics. Makweni Governor Kivuta Kibwana also saw the result as a sign of change in the region's politics, pointing out that the people of Ngu Masumba were opening a new chapter in the region's politics. Okay, in my reading number one, the shift is not as they proclaim it to be. Because what this shows, by choosing an, an independent candidate, it just shows that the people are willing to go beyond political parties and look at the candidate and what the candidate has to offer. Number two, I tend to read it as a mistake by Wiper and Uda in equal sense that they got concentrated too much on fighting each other and they missed out, that they missed out on the electorate themselves. That an independent candidate could beat them because they were too consumed. Uh, trying to outreach each other. Uh, in as much as the upper principles were traversing the, the word, uh, there was also some really good, some really concentrated effort by the Uda party. And now you can see from the results that the Uda party is quote unquote celebrating that they beat the Wiper candidate. But in all, in all, in all they all lost. The, shift of the, people. the by election that was occasioned by the death of former MCA Harrison Ngui was largely seen as a supremacy contest between Governor Kibwana, Kalonzo Musioka, and William Ruto. So for Raila's part, he has been cropping up Kivuda, Mutua, and Gilu to work against Kalonzo. In Western, he has been cropping up the likes of Oparanya to beat Musali Mudavadi, and so on and so forth. So in so doing, uh, this particular one was trying to show uh, both the hustler and the organization that we can actually do without either of you. As the dust settles on yesterday's result, eyes will remain trained on the region, with new entrants seeking to challenge the status quo ahead of the elections in 2022. Calvin Kodalo, Look Up TV, Nairobi.